Welcome to our course on concept analysis. My name is Mauro Calise. I am a professor of political science at the University of Naples, Federico II. We shall analyze together the basic vocabulary of the discipline and such keywords as party, bureaucracy, public opinion, democracy, constitution, legislature. The main aim of our course is to try and disentangle the complexity, variety of definitions and empirical cases which these concepts encompass. And we'll do so by using an interactive tool, a web platform, which is both a written book, but also a new tool that will contribute to your understanding of the concept and to, to your own making of this concept that we shall be explaining. This book has been written by me with Professor Ted Lowy, one of the founding fathers of the discipline, and unfortunately is not able to join us, but I'm very happy to welcome Professor Werner Patzelt, a German colleague from the University of Dresden, who is going to be with us all along in this new very challenging enterprise. So, Werner, what is this hyperpolitics platform all about? Well, the hyperpolitics platform and the whole approach of hyperpolitics is about conceptual analysis. So, what can you expect from this class on hyperpolitics? First of all, you get an introduction into conceptual thinking what it is about, why it is important, what its most important tools are. And then, you, of course, get a very in-depth introduction into the guiding ideas of hyperpolitics. That is, what are the dictionaries out of which its core vocabulary is taken and why are these the important dictionaries and how was this vocabulary assembled? And the core element of hyperpolitics is the matrix, a matrix around one central concept around which you uh, collect and give order to 12 additional concepts which allows you to integrate theoretical thought out of the literature into your own reflections. And because theory is the one thing and practice is a different thing, you will see some discussions between my colleague Mauro Calise and myself which show you how this approach of hyperpolitics is put into practice and what the standards for good quality are. You will have seen that both of us are really enthusiasts about hyperpolitics. But Maru, why are we so enthusiastic about hyperpolitics? The reason why we are so enthusiastic is because this is a way that we can empower your mind in political understanding and conceptual theory building. And as Ted Lowy would say, this is the best way to make yourself become your own Aristotle. So be bold, be innovative, be trustful that your theories can come true and become something new for yourself and for political science. <laughs> Oh,